Hey guys, it's Grim. Uh, today I just want to show you how you can um, get your switches into a room in regards to the floor plan. So um, normally you have the, if you look at the switches and you can have the, the dashboard as well, you can see here the room that's actually there. So you can uh, assign one of your switches to a specific room. So you can just map out all your rooms so and you can click to I just want all my switches in my living room and you can get all that. Um, so these you have to um, insert once and you can do that at, under the setup button. Um, you click more options and you click room plan. Now here I can actually create a room plan uh, and in that room plan I can actually give um, so I can give my TV room and I can give which switch I would like to have there. And I could do that for every single room, if you can see here. Great. So let's just create a test room. Uh, so I can click add plan, upper right corner, and I can just click I want to have my test or um, let's call it balcony, better name. Get all my switches on my balcony in, and I click add. Now I have here number 10, I have my balcony in. Um, there is no devices whatsoever just uh, attached to the, uh, to the room itself. So I can just click uh, the one that I would like to have on. And I would like to have as an example, I would like to have my set temperature uh, in, and I would like to have my uh, uh, seeing Christmas lights. I want to have switched on if I have that. Um, and then I actually created a new room with two attached devices to it. So if I go back to the switches and I click my balcony. Oh, that's funny. Oh, foolish me. <laughs> if you go back to the room plan, you can see that you can add every device in there. So if I click my balcony again, you can see that I've got my um, temperature and I've got my Christmas lights, but it's a scene, it's not a switch. So if I go back to a switch, it's quite normal that there is no switching because I didn't add any switch. So, um, and you can actually see here in the dashboard that if I click room balcony, you can actually see what's attached to it. So make sure you know what you're doing and you know what you put where. So if you put a switch to a room or a scene to a room or a utility sensor to a room, it makes a lot of, of difference on where you actually see it. Okay, um, that's it for today. Next time we're going to tackle some more floor plans um, and I'm probably going to show you the, uh, the mobile Android app for Demotics and I will um, let you see how you can actually access your Demotics installation from the outside. But for today, that's basically it. Um, I would like to thank you guys. If you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up and follow my channel. It would be very much appreciated. Thank you guys. Cheers. Bye.